Hello. Ciao, ciao. Welcome, welcome back after a long, a lot of time. Welcome back in Tuscany. Spring is arriving. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Wherever you are, you are always welcome here. So I wait that someone arrives and then we start with our lovely artichokes. In the meantime, firstly, we show you them. <laughs> then we will see how to manage <laughs> artichokes. Uh, anyway, just uh, some tips uh, and some suggestion how to use them fully. So, and to use uh, the whole potential of this wonderful vegetable that is uh, super good for your liver, for your cholesterol, for your, it's full of antioxidant, is full in iron. So super good properties for your health and super taste. Uh, ciao Joe, can you write if you can hear? And we can then start. I put a little bit behind. Ciao, 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 ciao. Welcome to everyone that is arriving. And uh, we start. So today, I show you how I clean the artichokes and so jo Joanna, <laughs> um, how my granny was teaching me how to clean the artichokes very, very quickly. I saw, honestly, I have seen some videos also, you know, on the net in which they, people um, cut these parts and so on. We treat them much more roughly. <laughs> okay, Joe, thank you, thank you so much, Joe. Thank you so much. So, I show you how to clean. But first of all, as in this, uh, in this live streaming, we clean them, we make a salad with artichokes, and we use uh, the steamer for a sauce, okay, that you can use uh, um for pasta or for a bruschetta or something ciao connie ciao 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 so first of all as the steam have to cook we work on the steam firstly so i put you down ah another thing i want to show you the knives that i'm um, i'm using so for the uh, steams i use this one this is a, a simple knife very simple one euro knife to clean uh, the vegetables for vegetables and then for the raw roughy parts i use this one with you know with the teeth okay but this is also a normal knife okay and this is also for peeling vegetables okay this i use just these three maybe these two are enough okay ciao lene ciao tineke ciao <laughs> so Let's get started. So, what we need now? We need the steam. So, I cut them here on the base. Okay, this way. This we work then later. Here we cut this part. And then we, we have to save, I don't know if you see, the white part. Okay, so I cut again for, let's say, easier way to manage. And we just remove the outside part. So you have just, the, let's say, the whiter part inside, okay? And we continue in this way with all of them. Ciao, Victoria, Charlene. So. so we just remove 
in this way. If you do in another way, I will be very, very curious to know how <laughs> you manage this part of the artichokes. Okay, for this, uh, now we made a sauce, but there are many different ways uh, to save uh, this part of the artichoke. Okay, let's take others. Otherwise, we need a lot, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Otherwise, the sauce is too small. But just to let you understand and to show you, and then you can manage with the quantities. So this is, let's say, a recipe that includes our principle that in the kitchen we don't throw away nothing. So we try to save as much as possible from everything or to reuse or to include in other recipes and so on. Also because I don't like to waste things. This is in general. Ciao Rita, ciao Rita, how are you? <laughs> how are you Rita? These are our, we take another one, another small, I have, so we make a, a small sauce, but we can do it. So very easy. Okay, we reduce this in small pieces, very, very small pieces. So this live will live streaming will be a little bit longer than the others because I show you <laughs> different things and but of course you can then when you watch it again you can <laughs> go over some point in which I am just cutting when once you have understood Okay, here there is just a little bit more of green part to remove. And off we go. There are some mm -hmm. just a little bit more. Okay, then I I tell you how to clean your hands because I don't like a to wear gloves while I cook because the, let's say, the perception of things uh, and what you have in your hands, from my, from my point of view, my personal point of view, is not the same. So I prefer doing in this way. And it's still rough, this part. Ciao Janine. A little bit more you can see there is a little bit of green and I'm going to remove this this is just because it's harder to let's say takes more to cook but you can leave it if you want so, <laughs> so I have cutted with you this so I have cutted our lovely inner part, the core of the <laughs> steam of the artichokes, and now we go to make a sauce. I move you here, as always, and then we manage the other things. <laughs> so, let's raise, the... okay, a little bit of butter, just a bit. and extra virgin olive oil together we 
you let it melt here i have leeks leeks cut in small pieces hmm? so now we wait that the butter is melted And we put not all is, is too much this just to, because uh, the steams are not so so many but just to show you and uh, we let them fry a little bit more then i will give you all the quantities as always if you have any questions please write Ciao Lorenza, buonasera. As always, we have to wait. <laughs> In the meantime, I take a little bit of water because we need it. Okay, let's fry a little bit this, the leeks. Ciao Anna Marie, the water is done it. Ciao Leanna. Ciao, 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 welcome. So, they are frying. We let them fry a little bit, a bit of salt. And a very, 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 very small pinch, very, very small of sugar. Then we let them cook and then we go on with our artichokes. <laughs> Just let them fry another minute. Of course with the butter, mixing butter and olive oil it's frying slower. So you know that I don't like uh, to use butter so much. Also because it's not in our culture. But I have some exceptions. And when I use leeks, I always put a little bit of butter. Because I I think that the flavor then it in itself is much more, I would say, gentle. So 
that's why. <laughs> of water now we cover them and we let them go for 10 minutes and then we check we go back so now Okay. Okay, let's remove this part that we don't need for the moment. So now we made we prepare let's say the salad. How we clean them? Okay, we remove the down part all the leaves of this part so this one we eat them <laughs> i put in one side we will eat them <laughs> I show you then okay we arrive at this point more or less okay we cut again this part and we remove uh, this part okay outside now very roughly we take the knife with the teeth and we cut here to save let's say the white part and to remove the hardest part <laughs> you move also <laughs> okay so we have let's say the if the this part is a little bit rough you just remove it this way diagonal all right that's all then we cut them in two parts and in quarters of course you know there is the this part inside that you have to remove is not good and you just remove in this way okay so remove the inside part and also this this way then we take a bowl of water we put lemon juice this is one lemon okay and then wait i move you sorry just uh, to show you that i was preparing this and then you make very very thin slices with the artichokes like this very thin okay and you put into the water and lemon with all the, the artichokes that you have of course uh, um, putting them into the lemon avoid uh, to let them get dark and of course they get flavored 
so very very thin okay one second I check the legs <laughs> okay still there so we do again also with this happy shot again this part then we remove these sides then we cut this part in this way okay okay I do in this way otherwise <laughs> you move also because you are on the table <laughs> okay Okay, still tough, uh, very uh, rough part here. So I cut also this, this side, this way, around. <laughs> they are very hard. Very, very hard. Yeah, sometimes it depends what you find on the shops. But anyway, still good, very good. When you find artichokes and in which there is a lot of this part means that they are, let's say, not gone, but they are not so good. Anyway, the season means that the season then is over when they do it in this way. Continue to make our lovely thin slices. Let me know if you have ever eaten this salad, then if you have other recipes, please post the post. And please follow the rules. So make the recipe, <laughs> photos, description, ingredients, and no links. Thank you. <laughs> so these are our artichokes. I think I put another one if you are patient. <laughs> if you can follow me till the end, this will me be my dinner. <laughs> So this is a old artichoke I've already seen <laughs> because they are hard but doesn't matter this of course is a variety good to be cooked but I like so much to eat them raw that even if they are for boiling or for making a recipe with pasta or other things I love them so so much so much We cut this part that in this case, look, the white part is less because it's, this is an old artichoke. So we cut in two. Look, like, like I told you, look, inside, look, is a lot of this part. Means this is old. But we remove it and we eat any case <laughs> so yeah it's full look full of this part this was good to cook
if you if you feel while you cut that is hard remove this part because will not be good to eat raw of course i will i cut again this part you can hear i think okay so here we leave for the salad we leave them here for some minutes and we have <laughs> lots of I want to show you <laughs> lots of <laughs> things to throw but this part let's say anyway the whole artichokes but just to to show you okay this I put it one side okay in Toscana in Toscana we made uh, we make a pinsimonium I have made uh, I think it was one year ago exactly one year ago more or less a video on this group about what is pinsimonium pinsimonium is a simple combination of extra virgin olive oil salt and pepper some people put also a little bit of vinegar but i prefer not and with this uh, we eat uh, raw vegetables so now i make uh, a pinsimonium for you we usually have special caps uh, for it so this is for pinsimonium okay so i prepare for you and then we check how to eat uh, the artichoke so we put a little bit of salt this every person then has one of it of course so when you make green simonio pepper and a good extra virgin okay you go up go So, we mix it. One second, I check uh, <laughs> the legs. <laughs> I put a little bit more of water. I let them cook uh, completely. So now, this part, the white part, we just put here and we eat. Okay? All the white part of the artichokes, we eat them. And uh, I cannot avoid it during this period. okay so if i eat um, an artichokes i eat it completely show you cut one artichoke so all the leaves the white part of the leaves and this part avoiding of course the center i will put it on into the pincimoyo and i will eat okay so, and this part, the white part, of course, is, is, is it the best one? Ciao, Daria! <laughs> it's the best one, this part, okay? So, just to let you know how we eat the raw artichokes. <laughs> so, wait, I move you here because the... I have a drop. <laughs> drop of water. So, I want to just to show you here they are going super tender mm -hmm. when the water is all evaporated they are ready Ciao Gary, ciao ciao ciao. 
So here I have a big mess with all these <laughs> artichokes. But this, I still remember when my granny was um, when my granny was preparing the artichoke fillet. You know, she was removing the outside part of this, this, and that was behind there, taking this and making pin simonio because it's I love them. I really love them. And we eat many, many artichokes from February till May. Of course, because it's the period in which we can have them fresh, then it's frozen. So, another thing that I want to, to say to you, when you eat artich raw artichokes, <laughs> you will have... Um, mm, Oh, sorry. You will have mm, much more black teeth, a little bit more black uh, tongue, and also a little bit the lips when you have eaten one, two complete artichokes. And you will have a sensation to have something this way in your mouth. But go to the bathroom, uh, toothpaste. Clean your teeth, toothpaste, and a little bit of bicarbonate, and brush also your tongue, and it will be better, of course. Then the sensation will go in a couple of hours, but it works, really, it works. Then, also with the uh, hands, uh, working with artichokes, they look, became darker. But you can take Christian's lemon that they have used for the salad. You can use and you can massage inside and then uh, and also with a bit of bicarbonate will be better then. And then during the day we also this will go. You, you wash your hands two or three times during the day will go. Okay, I prefer not using the gloves uh, even if it happened this. I, um, I prefer to do it in this way. We go here. <laughs> okay, still a little bit of water. Okay. When it's in this way, oh sorry, you don't see. When it's in this way with a little bit of liquid, hmm, these are let's say ready. When there is a little bit of liquid, you can, with a blender, you can reduce them in cream and use for pasta. Or, much more better, much more better, you wait that the water is evaporating completely, and then you add a little bit of, um, at your place is alfalfa cream, or a little bit of uh, mascarpone, and you reduce everything in cream to make uh, still to make it use for pasta okay so this is a, a variation how to use them also with uh, philadelphia cheese you can use ricotta every cheese that in a process makes then a cream is perfect bechamel bechamel also very good so this is these are the two Two things uh, still selling your cookbook recipes yes Gracie still selling and we are working on the web shop so that will be easy to buy just a click <laughs> so I think these are ready so I put them off and we dedicate ourselves to the salad so I make space if possible <laughs> okay then I clean okay so here you are we have our lovely artichokes from the lemon with the lemon and we take now a, a kitchen cloth and we remove from the washer as we put 
them here it's very very quick very very quick just the time to prepare you just uh, dry a little bit look how they are white so beautiful i have to eat uh, in the pinsimonio <laughs> so good so now we take uh, a bowl put our lovely artichokes They are too many, okay, doesn't matter. So we take our artichokes. Then, this is Parmesan cheese with in uh, um, scaglie in Italiano, I don't know in English, but in very, very thin pieces. And these are, let's say, I found at the supermarket already in this way, okay? And you put them on. Then salt, pepper, good extra virgin. Don't be shy with extra virgin. And uh, let's mix. This is so good. This is so good. Some parmesan cheese on steel for decoration and a little bit of parsley. Salad with parmigiano and raw artichokes. So delicious. So delicious. Believe me, it's really delicious this. When it's on the table, always finish, always, always, always. So we go also to put a little bit of um, parsley in our artichokes in the in the saucepan. I put them off because then I will process them, and I will I will add. Uh, just a spoon of I think I have mascarpone so I will put this but this is also a good option to save everything in the kitchen and to then say use with for pasta they are so good so so good so sorry today I was moving you up and down there but at the end I show you <laughs> different things so the large spoon and fork mixing evokes memory of my mom cooking. Oh, crazy. <laughs> yes, this is this. We use just few things. Uh, we don't need them mm, many. Oh, sorry. We don't need. Uh, sorry, it was the mobile. I had to switch it off. We don't need so many, mm, uh, let's say, modern tools. Uh, I usually use very basic tools and also when I do my cooking class, also live streaming, uh, virtual classes, I never ask for to buy something because we can normally use the things that you have in your kitchen without buying no, no things really. So, I love my dinner. <laughs> Look at this. It's so good with Parmesan, the combination Parmesan and artichokes is very, very good. 
but try also the don't throw away the stems and uh, stamps stems stamps stamps i think <laughs> and make a nice sauce for pasta we see us soon we see us on sunday with lasagna with artichokes so we will cook the artichokes and then we will use into the lasagna ciao thank you to for having been here till the end <laughs> ciao